NBA fines the Dallas Mavericks $750,000. The team's leading scorer for the season, Luka Doncic, played only in the first quarter of the game. The Mavericks violated the league's player resting policy and demonstrated through actions in public statements the organization's desire to lose the game in order to improve the chances of keeping its first-round pick in the 2023 NBA draft, the NBA said in a statement. The league did not find that the players who participated in the game were not playing to win. On Friday, the Mavericks sat Irving, right foot injury recovery, Maxi Kleber, right hamstring injury recovery, Christian Wood, rest, and Josh Green, rest, in the 115-112 loss to the Bulls despite the team still being in contention for a spot in the play-in. The Mavericks entered that game tied with Chicago for the 10th best lottery odds in the 2023 NBA Draft. However, Dallas owes the New York Knicks a top-10 protected first round as part of the trade for power forward and center Kristaps Porzingis, who has since been dealt to the Washington Wizards. If Dallas pick falls in the top-10, the team gets to keep it. If it falls outside of that, it goes to the Knicks. With the defeat against the Bulls, Dallas was unable to reach the postseason. NBA Executive Vice President Joe Dumars said the Mavericks failed our fans in our league against the Bulls. The Dallas Mavericks' decision to restrict key players from fully participating in an elimination game last Friday against Chicago undermined the integrity of our sport, Dumars added. The Mavericks declined to comment on the investigation when it was announced, and head coach Jason Kidd said the decision to rest players was made by his bosses, owner Mark Cuban and general manager Nico Harrison. Anticipation is high ahead of this year's NBA draft, which takes place on June 22, with highly rated 19-year-old Victor Wimbanyama likely to be the top pick.